Hi, in this video we're going to show you how to extend a volume using the new Windows 11 Discs and Volumes tool. Uh, we used to have this in Windows 10, but then they took it away for some reason, but so far they're keeping it in Windows 11. So on this computer, we have the C drive, and we have this D drive, 60 gigs, but it's really a uh, 80 gig drive. So we're going to take up the other 20 gigs here. So what you could normally do is go to Disk Management, And then you have the uh, 60 here and the 20 here. Then right-click on it and extend. But if you want to do the new and improved way, you could go to the uh, settings. Under system, look for storage. Advanced storage settings. And then disks and volumes. And then here you'll have your actual drives broken down and then your volumes as well. So let's say you want to go to the, actually let's do the one with windows on it. You can go to the properties, you can see how much space is used, change the labels, see the file system. We did a video on all this stuff, but I'll just give you a quick overview. You can even uh, explore it, open it up from there. And then if you click on you know, the disk itself, you know, see what type of disk it is, check the health and all that good stuff. But what we want to do is this one drive here. So here's our 60 gigs and here's our unallocated disk there, or space. So click on create volume. Or actually, now we want to go to Properties and click on Change Size because if you were to create a volume, you'd create a new volume. So we want to actually go to Properties and then Change Size. And then it'll tell you the current. And then you can put in the max. So we could put in 81903 to use it all. Click OK. And now you can see we have the uh, whole thing used. So if we go back to... Uh, File Explorer, you can see we got the whole 80 gigs, so super quick. So just another way to do it if you don't like a disk management. And if you want to have all these little extra features to check all the status of your drive and that kind of good stuff. So once again, from System and your Settings, Storage, Advanced Storage Settings, and then Disk and Volumes, and then you could uh, take it from there. All right, thanks for watching, and be sure to subscribe. <laughs>